Hello, everyone. Welcome back to God First Channel, the place where we explore ways to enhance our lives through inspiration and motivation. Today's topic is truly special, how to experience the good things God wants for you. We all seek fulfillment, blessings, and positivity in our lives, and today, we'll delve into seven powerful steps to align ourselves with the good things that God has in store for each one of us. So, grab a pen and paper, and let's get started. Before we dive in, if you're new here, be sure to subscribe and hit the notification bell to stay inspired by our faith-based content. Let's get started. Before we dive into the steps, it's essential to recognize that we are all on unique journeys, and our paths may differ. However, the principles we'll discuss today are universal and can be applied to various aspects of our lives. So, let's embark on this transformative journey together. Step 1. Develop a strong spiritual foundation. As we embark on this transformative journey, let's delve into the first step, developing a strong spiritual foundation. Imagine your spiritual life as the roots of a tree, anchoring you firmly in the soil of faith and purpose. Find a quiet space where you can connect with the divine. Whether it's a cozy corner in your home, a beautiful natural setting, or a sacred place of worship, create an environment that fosters a sense of peace and tranquility. Engage in daily prayer, a direct line of communication with the divine. Share your thoughts, dreams, and concerns, fostering a relationship that transcends the material world. Prayer becomes the foundation upon which you build a deeper connection with God. Embrace meditation, a practice that allows you to still the chaos of the outside world and turn inward. Focus on your breath, allowing your mind to settle and your spirit to commune with the divine presence within. Explore different spiritual practices that resonate with your soul, whether it's reading sacred texts, engaging in rituals, or participating in communal worship. These practices become the threads that weave your spiritual tapestry. By consistently engaging in these practices, you fortify your spiritual foundation, creating a sturdy anchor that will provide guidance and strength in times of challenge and uncertainty. Let your spiritual journey be a personal and meaningful exploration of the divine within and around you. Now that we've laid the groundwork with a strong spiritual foundation, let's move on to the second step on our journey to experiencing the good things God wants for you, cultivating a grateful heart. Step 2. Cultivate a grateful heart. As we continue our journey to unlock the blessings meant for you, let's explore the second step, cultivating a grateful heart. Gratitude is like sunlight, illuminating the darkest corners of our lives and allowing the seeds of positivity to grow. Start by keeping a gratitude journal. Each day, take a few moments to reflect on the things you're thankful for. It could be the warmth of the morning sun, the laughter of loved ones, or the simple joys that often go unnoticed. Express your gratitude not only in writing but also in your actions. Take a moment to tell someone you appreciate them or lend a helping hand to those in need. Sharing gratitude magnifies its impact, creating a ripple effect of positivity. Train your mind to find joy in the small things. It could be a cup of coffee in the morning, a kind word from a friend, or the beauty of nature. By acknowledging and savoring these moments, you open your heart to the abundant blessings surrounding you. Create a ritual of reflection, perhaps during sunrise or sunset, to connect with the divine source of your gratitude. Let this time be a sacred pause in your day, acknowledging the goodness that flows into your life. Cultivating a grateful heart is like tending to a garden, the more you nurture it, the more it blossoms. By appreciating the present moment and expressing gratitude, you create a magnetic force that attracts the good things God has prepared for you. Now that we've embraced gratitude, let's move on to the third step, aligning your actions with your values. Step 3. Align your actions with your values. As we journey deeper into the path of divine alignment, our third step is a pivotal one, aligning your actions with your values. Imagine your values as the compass guiding your journey, and your actions as the steps that shape the path before you. Begin by reflecting on your core beliefs and values. What principles resonate with your soul? What do you hold dear in your heart? Understanding your values is the first step toward living a purposeful and meaningful life. Every day, make a conscious effort to align your actions with these values. Whether it's in your relationships, your work, or your personal pursuits, let your values be the guiding force behind every decision you make. Extend the reach of your values through acts of kindness and service. 
when your actions are driven by a desire to uplift others, you create a positive ripple effect that not only impacts your life but also the lives of those around you. Living in alignment with your values brings a deep sense of fulfillment. It's about authenticity, being true to yourself, and walking a path that resonates with the essence of who you are meant to be. Remember, when your actions align with your values, you open yourself up to the divine flow of blessings. God delights in seeing His children live purposefully, and the more you align with your values, the more you attract the blessings that align with your truest self. Now, as we continue our journey, let's explore the fourth step, practicing kindness and compassion. Step 4, Practice Kindness and Compassion As we immerse ourselves in the transformative journey, our fourth step invites us to become vessels of divine love, practicing kindness and compassion. Imagine your actions as gentle ripples, spreading waves of positivity throughout the sea of humanity. Practice kindness in your everyday interactions. A smile, a kind word, or a small act of assistance can brighten someone's day and create a positive atmosphere. Be intentional about spreading joy wherever you go. Extend compassion to those around you. Take a moment to understand others' perspectives, empathize with their struggles, and offer a listening ear. Compassion is a powerful force that bridges gaps and nurtures understanding. Engage in acts of kindness that resonate with your heart. It could be volunteering your time, donating to a charitable cause, or simply being there for someone who needs support. These actions not only benefit others but also bring immense fulfillment to your life. Create a cycle of kindness by inspiring others to join in. When kindness becomes a collective effort, the ripple effect expands, creating a community where love and compassion flourish. In practicing kindness and compassion, you become a conduit for God's love to flow through you. By lifting others up, you create an environment where blessings can thrive, not only in your life but also in the lives of those touched by your acts of love. As we continue our journey, let's explore the fifth step, trusting God's timing. Step 5. Trust God's timing. In our pursuit of divine blessings, the fifth step beckons us to embrace a virtue often challenging yet profoundly rewarding, patience. Let the ticking clock and the essence of waiting become a canvas upon which the masterpiece of God's plan unfolds. As we navigate the tapestry of our lives, the clock continues its steady rhythm. It's a reminder that God's timing operates beyond our understanding. Trust that every second brings you closer to the perfect unfolding of His plan. Cultivate patience in your daily life. Whether you're waiting for an opportunity, facing a challenge, or anticipating a change, understand that each moment is an essential part of a larger, divine design. Consider the growth of a seed into a plant. The process takes time, and each stage is vital for the plant to blossom. Similarly, trust that every experience, every delay, is a necessary part of your personal growth and the manifestation of God's plan. Surrender the need for control and allow God's timing to guide your journey. Sometimes, what may seem like a delay is actually a divine redirection towards something greater than you could have imagined. Remember, in trusting God's timing, you relinquish the burden of impatience and surrender to the wisdom of the divine. The blessings meant for you are intricately woven into the fabric of time, and by patiently awaiting their arrival, you align yourself with the perfect plan crafted for your life. As we continue our exploration, let's move on to the sixth step, seeking wisdom and guidance. Step 6 seek wisdom and guidance. In the pursuit of aligning ourselves with the divine path, our sixth step invites us to seek wisdom and guidance, recognizing that God provides insights through various channels. Let's explore how we can actively engage in this enriching journey. Delve into sacred texts that resonate with your faith. Whether it's the Bible, Quran, Bhagavad Gita, or other spiritual scriptures, these ancient teachings hold timeless wisdom that can illuminate your path and offer profound insights. Seek the guidance of wise mentors who embody the values and principles you aspire to incorporate into your life. Learning from those who have walked a similar path can provide invaluable insights and shortcuts to spiritual growth. Allocate time for introspection and meditation, seeking guidance from the divine within. In moments of stillness, allow your inner wisdom to surface, guiding you towards the right decisions and actions aligned with your spiritual journey. Surround yourself with positive influences and a supportive spiritual community. Engage in conversations that uplift your spirit and connect with like-minded individuals who share your values. Together, you can create an environment conducive to spiritual growth. By actively seeking wisdom through these channels, 
you align yourself with the divine path designed uniquely for you. Recognize that the pursuit of wisdom is a continuous journey, and each nugget of insight brings you closer to the divine purpose God has envisioned for your life. Now, let's explore the seventh and final step on our transformative journey, embracing faith over fear. Step 7, Embrace Faith Over Fear As we approach the final step in our transformative journey, let's delve into the powerful realm of faith, the beacon that illuminates our path, dispels the shadows of fear, and opens the door to the blessings God has prepared for us. Life is filled with challenges and obstacles. Embracing faith means confronting these hurdles with courage and determination. Trust that God is by your side, providing the strength needed to overcome any adversity. Fear can be a formidable barrier, preventing us from realizing our true potential. Choose to confront your fears head-on, acknowledging that through faith, you can conquer even the most daunting challenges. Replace fear with faith, and witness how doors previously unseen start to open. Trust that God's plan is vast and intricate, and by embracing faith, you align yourself with the divine currents that guide you towards the blessings meant specifically for you. Release the need for complete understanding and control. Instead, extend your hands in trust, believing that God's wisdom surpasses our comprehension. The more you trust in His plan, the more you open yourself to the abundance of His blessings. Embracing faith over fear is a continuous practice, a choice to believe in the unseen and to walk confidently on the path laid out by the divine. As you navigate life with unwavering faith, you become a magnet for the blessings God has meticulously woven into your journey. And there you have it, 7 Transformative Steps to Experience the Good Things God Wants for You From building a strong spiritual foundation to embracing faith over fear, each step contributes to the beautiful tapestry of a purposeful and blessed life. Thank you for joining us on this inspirational journey. Let us know in the comments which step resonated with you the most, and feel free to share your own experiences on the path to divine blessings. Until next time, may your journey be filled with joy, purpose, and the abundant blessings of the divine. Thank you, dear viewers, for embarking on this soul-enriching journey with us today. If you found these steps helpful or have your own experiences to share, feel free to leave a comment below. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe to God First channel for more uplifting content, and hit the notification bell to stay updated on our latest releases. If you're looking for more inspiration between our videos, connect with us on social media. We'd love to hear your thoughts, experiences, and any topics you'd like us to explore in future videos. Remember, you are not alone on this journey. May your days be filled with positivity, love, and the abundant blessings that God has prepared just for you. Until next time, take care, stay inspired, and may your path be illuminated by the divine light. Blessings to you all.